William here, fitnessforbackpain.com. Wanted to go over real quick foam rolling for the quads. Basically, um, you're just trying to smash and dominate this entire area here um, from inner to outer. I'm going to break up the inner thigh in a different video, but basically, uh, the quads, you're basically trying to hit based from the IT band um, to right where the inner thigh basically begins. Um, and you're just this whole area, you're trying to just work out all the knots, all the grisly areas that kind of gotten stuck. Um, a lot of times around the kneecap here, um, you have these little tiers of your main quad uh, muscles uh, that just over time get knotted up from just overuse and stuff like that. So working on this, um, working on the upper and trying to get these big bellies of the muscle to just relax. Uh, again, if you don't have any discomfort here, that's fine. But when you lay on the foam roller, you want to find that discomfort and that's where you're trying to find where it hurts so you can work and just and, and uh, um, I guess roll those places out okay so really the things you want to work on with this again is the contract relax technique um, that I talk about in some of my videos where you find a bad spot you contract your muscles relax allow your body to sink deeper into that muscle uh, trying to break up the deepest part of that muscle that you can um, again I use the analogy as the foam roller is kind of like uh, an ice plow in, in, in a lake or a river or ocean or something like that with a boat is, is literally going through those big um, layers of ice just breaking it all up so deep breaths try to go very slow um, you don't want to go fast over this painful area I know it hurts but go slower you'll have better uh, results faster results you may be a little bit more sore going slower but you'll have better results in the long run so um, one thing is range of motion Track, relax, I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. So again, just like anything else, the main thing is to look at um, just finding areas that are bad. Um, I try to just kind of float around and see where are my worst areas. And when I find one, what I'll do is I'll try to do the contract, relax technique. And I'll do that a couple times, move around a little bit, contract, relax. Um, what I'll also do is I'll try to find a place that I can kind of tack down. Like right there is tough for me, so if I can tack that spot down and I'll bring my leg through its range of motion. Move it again, tack it down, relax. And I'm pulling that quad through that, that tack that I've kind of created with the foam roller. Um, another thing you want to watch for is where you are here. Um, if you have a lot of back pain and back issues, sitting like this isn't going to be a good situation for you after a while. Too much extension. So try to keep your, your abs engaged the entire time. Almost like you're trying to do a plank, supporting my body weight with my arms here. Um, again, you're trying to roll around, find those spots that are kind of weird. Once you find one, sit down on it, contract, relax. Also, you can tack it down with the foam roller and pull it through and just try to break up as much nastiness as you can just like that okay so that's the quad again you can work anywhere use it all over the quad the technique works no matter if you're here here or here use the contract relax the range of motion um, that 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 tack the tack down technique um, and 